I washed my hair like four days ago, so I pretty much did a wash and go. Sunday is usually my wash day, and then after I wash and deep condition my hair, I like to get out the shower, and then I'll style my hair with a leave-in conditioner and a cream, sometimes a gel, but not all the time. I'll usually keep my hair like that for about four days until I refresh it again. By Thursday, my scalp is feeling a little tingly, my hair is feeling a little more dry, it's feeling like it needs a refresher. Like when I say my scalp is tingly, I mean like my scalp is itchy if you ever feel inclined to scratch your scalp after not washing your hair for a long time that typically means that your scalp needs it refreshing if your hair doesn't have that like you know that sheen to it I mean it doesn't have to be super shiny but if it just looks like dull like and it looks a little dry even when you feel it it doesn't feel as moisturized and that means that you need to refresh your hair so typically today on Thursdays I will co-wash my hair to refresh my hair um, and then after I co-wash it um, co-washing is pretty much just cleansing your hair with conditioner so yeah I like to do that and then after I'll put a leave-in conditioner and then I'll style my hair again but today I am trying something different so instead of co-washing my hair to refresh it like I normally would I'm going to be using bounce back curl reviving mist by Ava NYC. It's supposed to reactivate your curls, it's supposed to moisturize of course, and it's supposed to tame frizz. And I love these kind of products. This is certified vegan, if anybody cares about that. I care about that because I don't eat meat or dairy products. I don't like to label myself as vegan because you know, some people are very extreme when it comes to veganism as far as clothes and makeup and stuff like that and I'm not like fully there yet. And it's cruelty free, which is good. Um, and it's powered by aloe leaf, cactus flower, and it doesn't have any sulfates, parabens, and phytholates, whatever the heck that means. I don't know, but I know it's not good for you, right? <laughs> so it pretty much just tells you it delivers an instant energy jolt to tired, fallen curls. It doesn't look too bad. I just feel like it smells a little... It doesn't smell as fresh because it's been like four days and now that it's summertime like when you're outside a lot and you're moving around and you get like your, your hair kind of smells like outside pretty much I really like the idea of having like a reviving mist especially if this mist smells good I don't know I haven't smelled it yet but it'll give my hair a little refresher for those days when you don't feel like doing the whole refresher routine it's just the lazy girl in me that's like yes I don't have to do the whole co-wash routine today I can skip out on my refresh routine and it's like my whole routine in a whole bottle <laughs> so that's why I'm so excited so hopefully this works pretty well it's a lightweight mist that reactivates and redefines your curl pattern it's supposed to make your next day curls left feeling soft springy and full of bounce I'm doing this on super old wash and go so hopefully it works as well it says use me on dry pre-styled curls that need a lift spritz all over hair and then tilt head forward and scrunch in an upward motion to coat Okay, hair flip for good measure. Okay, I can do a good hair flip. Mm. Mm. Oh my, boom. My hair looks a lot better. And is it just me? This is a little sticky. I feel like I'm using a lot of it. But you guys see that? Look at my... I really like it. I like how my hair feels. Like my hair feels revived. Like because it sprays it well. So my hair even feels softer. And the spray is really nice. Like it sprays really well. It's like a psh. It's not like a psh. You get, you get what I'm saying? <laughs> okay.
like getting whiffs of my hair. I love that. This isn't like a super strong, like sweet scent. It's like a natural smelling scent that I feel like isn't too overpowering. If I could smell it, I'm pretty sure when I walk by somebody, they could probably smell it. And I just love that feeling because I've walked by girls before and their hair smells so good. And I was just like, whoa, like it, it leaves like a lasting impression. But anyways, my hair's refreshed. Thank goodness. Thank you, Spray, that I did not have to do my routine today and I could wait to wash my hair tomorrow. cream which is by Ava NYC as well but unfortunately <laughs> this has sweet almond oil in it and I was really looking forward to trying this because I love this so much and this is in the same line or collection as this so thankfully I'll still be able to use this you guys will see this in future videos for sure but I won't be able to try this curl defining cream. It's supposed to define curls, tame frizz, moisturizes. So it's really good if you want to style your curls. Because right now I only have a leave-in conditioner. And the purpose of a leave-in conditioner is to moisturize. It's not really a product that you will like use if you want super defined, frizzless, uh, weighed down curls. So that's what the curl defining cream is but i don't mind like i don't always want my hair to be super defined my hair is definitely moisturized if you could feel it it feels super soft um and it's more like bouncy natural curls like this is what you would call my natural curls because it's not like super defined it's like how my curls naturally look um when they're moisturized <laughs> today obviously we all know we love having our hair our curls looking super defined no frizz but sometimes I've been learning over the course of my natural hair journey to just embrace my hair in its actual natural state which is when it's just you know it's still moisturized like if you can feel my hair it feels like a pillow right now it's like super soft and fluffy and and just luscious <laughs> uh, my boyfriend loves my hair when it's like this because it's more like natural and it's like look how big it is like it's like super big and fluffy and nice and it feels good also it gives me like 
70s is that the vibe it's like old school vibes when they had you know curly big hair and it wasn't super like about definition all the time and i think it goes really cute with the scrunchy and it's very big so i think it just looks better with bigger hair and i'm loving it a lot since i wasn't able to try the curl defining cream i'm going to be giving it away to one of you if you want to know how to enter the giveaway check the description box below and um, make sure you follow all the steps if you don't follow all the steps then you're not gonna be able to enter I just feel like this is gonna be like a nice staple product for the summer when we're out I notice in the summertime your hair obviously dries up quicker because you're outside um, you also start sweating more like your hair starts smelling which I don't like so this is like perfect and convenient for when you're out we could just spritz our hair give our hair a little refresher honestly this may go in my purse for those days where i just want to refresh my hair i hope you enjoyed this video and obviously if you watched until the end i would love to know who are the real supporters who watched until the end since these are pink let's comment three pink hearts so i can show you so much love and i will see you in my next video which maybe i can continue the series summer inspo and let me know which was your favorite look did you like look one or did you like look two i think i'm loving look two honestly i just love the i just love Ooh, and my hair smells like i'm not even over exaggerating but okay anyways